Good morning, Rogers Park. Please join me, my friend, Izal, in saying the Pledge of Allegiance. A Pledge of Allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to a republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thanks, Isal. Today, everyone, is Thursday, December 10th, and we're coming towards the end of our B-Week. Your classes are up here on the screen. They're in power school, and I hope that you're engaging in class. Please continue to enjoy the crossover by Kwame Alexander, read aloud by Mr. Medina. Trimester 2 art students, please come to the school on any Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, or Friday between 745 and 245 to pick up your art supplies for Trimester 2. Reach out to Ms. Wellman or Ms. Kulbik-Simone with any questions. Seventh graders, I hope by now that you have checked your Science Google Classroom, the email I sent you, and you've shown your parents the forensic opt-out form. Math Club, you have a meeting today at 3 o'clock. Please use the link in the Google Classroom and email Ms. Schussler with any questions. Concert Choir members, your next rehearsal is today, Thursday, December 10th at 2.45. Reach out to Mr. Walden with any questions. Jazz Band, we will be having our first meeting on Friday, December 11th from 2.45 to 3.15. Join with the Meet link in the Jazz Band Google Classroom. Newspaper, you'll be meeting on Monday, December 14th at 3 o'clock. See you then. Karen Marillo is here to talk to you a little bit about the sock drive. National Junior Honor Society is hosting a sock drive that will benefit the Dorothy Day House in Danbury. Donations of new socks can be brought to Rogers Park from now until December 22nd. Socks must be new in their package. No use socks. Thank you. I wanted to share something with you this morning that I learned as I was driving into work today. On December 21st, Jupiter and Saturn, which are actually separated by more than 400 million miles, are going to appear closer to each other in the night sky than they have for centuries. They haven't appeared this close since the year 1226. So starting tonight, if you go outside in the hour right after sunset, you can start to see them in the night sky. And Saturn is going to be on the left and Jupiter on the right. And over the next 11 days, they're going to start to move closer and closer. And on the 21st, they're going to appear a tenth of a degree apart. That's about the thickness of a dime held at arm's length. Something cool to look at that you don't need anything but your eyeballs. So I hope that you take a moment to go out and enjoy the science that's all around you. That's it for today, Rogers Park. We miss you. Stay safe and do your work.